Good morning. Years ago, I pulled up late night over here and I saw all the cars that were out here. It was years ago and you had a lot of Impalas and stuff. And I said, one day I'm gonna come down here and see what's going on. So how many, because I, I, what I'm looking for is a 61 bubble top car. Um, I have a 64. How much you got? I know, I know How they, much they, you got? I know that those cars, those are pricey. They're very pricey. Yeah, because I have a, um, a 62, a 63, and a 64. Right. And I just bought a 70 Chevelle convertible yesterday. Uh -huh. And so I was like, man, let me come down here one day. If I'm thinking about coming out one on one, let me talk to the young man who I runs this and see if how pricey is that thing. They start crazy pricey. Uh huh. Depending upon, like this one's all original. Mm hmm. This one here is $38,000. Okay, okay. So, 327, 300 horsepower, original uh -huh. motor, tranny. Got 27. Automatic or four speed? Oh, four speed. Four speed. What? Now, if I take a look inside? Well, look at it. Oh, okay, okay. So, my question was, is also this because I like to work on cars, make my cars my own. You wouldn't happen to have the ones that haven't, you collect the ones that are parsy in on the way, or you'd get them all already done already when before you I put them out to there? I buy them all together now because nobody wants to work on them. Okay, yeah, nobody wants to paint these cars. They want an astronomical fee to paint them nowadays. Yeah. And live by shops will say, well, we want to do insurance work. We don't want to work on the old car. Yeah. And um, then that relegation to the other guys who are charging outer limit prices to paint things nowadays. Crazy. Yeah. So I just stopped. I used uh, to restore them. I had a restoration place myself. Okay. Not no more. Yeah, because years, like I said, years ago I came, it was the whole lineup was all the over. I, had I would seven say about. Of them. Yeah, I saw them out here. It was nighttime. I pulled up right there. I was like, my yeah. goodness, I got to come back. 63, 64s. Yeah. But yeah. I can't buy them anymore. Yeah, the prices. Uh, they're way know. up, but they're not original. Yeah. They're retro modded or they're. All that bullshit, and I don't want that. People don't want, they, when they want to buy a classic car, they want to. They want it as it was, what they remembered as a kid type of scenario. Good okay. morning. Well, I, I was just out here, so I thought I'd stop and ask yeah, a few questions. I'm sorry, I just, uh, off the top of my head, I don't know of anybody that has something that needs to be done. Okay. All right, I appreciate your time. Just, uh, just periodically check in because well, I'll tell you what happens. People stop in here. I had one lady want to sell her Corvette, another guy went to sell a Mustang, a uh -huh. All the bullshit goes on every day. Okay, so it changes from day to day. Yeah. Do you guys have a business card or yeah, something I, I can get from I you? Just gave the last one off. <laughs> hey, thank you much, man. I appreciate it. Yeah, just give us a call if some of the stuff will be listed under what cars? Yeah, cars are okay. Cars okay, are so it's online. Like oh, okay, okay, cool, for sure. We try to put it there. Okay, you try to put it there. I said sometimes circumstances may not even make it there because it's already gone. Right. And that's my that's my old truck, my, my son like so. Okay. Alright, thank you very much for your time, my man. Have a good day. Uh -huh. Alright. Yeah. Out here early morning doing some swap meat shopping. Anybody need a Ford pickup truck? They got it for you. Out here in Santa Maria, California. You never know what you might find at a swap meet. So sometimes you just gotta throw your money at the gas and drive. To see what you might see. Sometimes a win, sometimes it's a loss. That joker is chopped down, for real, for real. Let's see what we got over here. These are old bomb parts, the Sotos and cars I don't know much about. But um, yeah, they got a little bit of everything out here today. So yeah, well, I saw all like I see. I guess it's time to salvage the day since I've. Been down here yeah, we to go up there too. for a minute. Yeah. And, uh, get on up out of here. Like I said, you never know what you're gonna see. All kinds of stuff. But doesn't look like there's anything I need here. Let's see what else we got. 
I don't got it. Ah, uh, that's from that smoke. Yeah, smoking. Yeah, we out here in San Maria, about to get back on this freeway, multitasking. Hell, we might as well go to Los Angeles now. I'm past halfway. Me and young Rob, that's the other side of Money's Car Stereo, the wire department. <laughs> he work when he want to work. You know how our kids be some down. <laughs> you know, anyway. You get on the right. Uh, yeah. Yeah, well, I'm paying him, so he don't, don't want to come to work, y'all. But anyway, <laughs> we're going to keep it pushing, run to L.A., make the day of it, buy some jeans, some shorts, something, and come on back home. Are we on the right side, though? We on the right side of Freeway Gibson, and we're going south. Once again, money's cross stereo. See you when I get there. Continues, y'all. We out here, coming to a city near you. Money's Car Stereo on tour. Yeah. You recording? Yeah. Like I said, man, we gotta stay ready, so you ain't gotta get ready. We out here in Inglewood, man. Talking with my people. He said we're gonna move some things, do some things. Man, tell America where we at today, man. Man, we in Los Angeles, California, man. Yeah, man. We, we Over come down here, here, man. This is good business right here. Man. This is customer oh. service are like no other. <laughs> <laughs> you were telling me earlier you were swinging a dating hammer, man. What you swinging on, man? Man, this shit wouldn't get unloose, man. It was like a little tricky, so oh, okay. you know I didn't want to, you know, have to pay for it, so yeah. You know, we bring out the old tools and... Yeah, we're gonna do a little... Yeah, 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 we'll figure it out. We got it. Good. Yeah, coming soon. We're gonna see what's going up on here next. chains up if you do your safety chains you put the twirl on it and you can go with the twist but if you don't go with the twist you're gonna sit there and drag the chains to death so you want to uh, do this man right here you saw this is a local U-Haul spot I was wondering what you gonna do with all that chain and he actually got under there and started just spinning it like this you know and he hooked it on Give me a second. Like that. Put this thing in there like that. I believe that's how it go. We'll put it there. Yeah, like that. That's like that. So now we ain't on the ground. Then we watch here watch the hell out of Beat me up there for that, boy. <laughs> Let me see. From there, we go to, uh, oh, here we go. Universal Bam. Yeah, you you so everybody, bam, bam, bam. 
Well, put them on front and I'll run this up there. So that will be our room to run up in. Okay, I'm gonna pull this up a little so we can get up in there, alright? Leave it here, right here. Who's the headlight made by? 